Hi, this is Caleb with App Design Tips, and in this video I want to give a note to Windows users about the differences between Windows and Mac when using Adobe XD. If you're using Adobe XD with Microsoft Windows, I want to just share a few notes here of things that might be different as you're following along with me. As you move on to the next video, you'll notice that I'm going to be talking about these menu items here. And for Windows users, for one reason or another, they don't have the same options here in the menu item. In fact, the only thing they do have is this hamburger menu right here. And if you click on this menu, you have a few options to create new projects, open projects, and do a few things inside of here. But to access some of the things I'm going to be talking about in the next video, you'll have to use keyboard shortcuts. Now I don't know if Adobe has plans in the future to add a file menu system here up at the top, but just to help Windows users follow along and access these same tools, I've added a keyboard shortcut cheat sheet that you can download and print off to be able to access these same kind of things. And you can find this PDF attached in the next lecture. Now I'm also going to be using a few keyboard shortcuts in these videos. And because I'm using a Mac, then I'm going to be holding down Command is my alternating button. For example, if I want to copy this, I would hold down Command C and Command V to paste. And that's for the Mac, but every time that I say Command for Windows users, if you use Control, you can use Control C and Control V, and it'll work the same way as the Command C and Command V. So anytime I talk about a shortcut with command, just use control instead for the windows.